In today's video, we take a look at the Pact One Travel Duffel, a 35 litre carry on duffel bag that carries like a traditional duffel but actually opens up clamshell like a suitcase. If you're new to the channel, I'm Ed from Rush Faster and we do guides and walkthroughs bringing you better gear and better ways to carry. So if you like what you see, please consider subscribing and also hitting that little bell. Let's dive in and check out the Pact One Travel Duffel. If you're not familiar with Pact, they are a carry company based in the US that are known for making considered travel carry goods. We've actually done a video on the Pact Travel Backpack, which was designed in collaboration with Chase Reeves. If you want to check that out, there is a link above right now. And stay tuned, we're also going to have a video on the Pact Anywhere collection, so that's coming up real soon. Keep an eye on that. But here today, we're looking at the Pact One Duffel Bag. If you want to check out any of the product specs or details, there is a link in the description below, as well as a little QR code on the screen for you to scan with your phone camera. And if you want to keep up to date with news happening in the carry world, we have a Rush Faster Carry Roundup newsletter that you can subscribe to where we talk about all that news and where we also give away some carry gear to our subscribers every month. So if you want to get in on that, subscribe to the channel and also subscribe to the newsletter. So let's look at some of the materials of the Pact One Duffel. It comes in three colors, black, gray and navy. The black colorway comes in a 420 denier nylon dobby. The gray and navy colorways come in a PU coated polyester canvas. All the colorways come with durable YKK RC zippers and they also have coated PU corners here for extra abrasion resistance. So quickly looking at the base here, you can see those corners that have been added with this PU coated fabric for extra abrasion resistance. And then we've also got these metal studs on the bottom here to just add a little bit of clearance from the bag and the ground. On the top here, we have two durable haul handles that come together in the middle reasonably thick haul handles but they are also soft so they will bend and mold to your palm when you're carrying it hopefully you can see on the sides of the bag on both sides we have these little loops here and these are to be hooked in with the attachable shoulder strap so the main carry mode for the packed one is with this shoulder strap which has this pretty chunky metal hardware here. These are the clips that will clip onto those loops there on the side that'll allow you to use the shoulder strap for the bag. We've also got metal ladder locks here. So these are also nice and chunky. And then in the middle, we have a padded shoulder pad that you can actually adjust along the shoulder strap so you can align it properly to where it's resting on your shoulder for a more comfortable and more ergonomic fit. And when you're not using the shoulder strap, you can just stow it away in the bag somewhere else if you just prefer to carry it by the haul handles. Okay, so let's take a look at the compartments of the Pact One Duffel. We've got some quick access compartments on the sides here, and then we've also got the main compartments in the middle. Looking at the side compartments, we've got two here at the front. On this side, we've just got a quick stash pocket so inside there, I've got my Bellroy travel folio, which stores my passport and other travel related documents, tickets, things like that. Just one big stash space that is slightly gusseted. Hopefully you can see that little gusset there. It can expand out to fit bigger items if you need to. On this side, we've got a little bit of organization in this pocket here. So hopefully you can see here, there is a slip pocket. This is actually a slightly padded compartment. So you could put items that need a little bit of protection. You could put your phone in there if you wanted to. But here I've just got some Master and Dynamic MW08 Truly Wireless earphones. In front of that compartment, we've got a little mesh compartment there. And so you can further segment some gear inside there. I've got nothing in there at the moment. Next to that, there is a little pen slot and I've got an Everyman Grafton pen mini in there. And then over in the corner, we've got a little key tether which you can attach your keys to. So here I have my Orbit key and it's just secured onto this little clip. Nice and easy to locate my keys when I need to. On the other side, we have more organization for gear. So here we have one zippered compartment here. And in there, I've just got a little bit of quick access tech. So I've got my Nomad Kepler charging cable as well as a portable power bank from Nightcore. Here you can see there's a little bit of mesh and a zippered compartment here. This is Pax dedicated TSA pocket, which is this very simple zippered compartment here that allows you to empty out everything in your pockets. So things like your phone, maybe your passport. If you need to take off your watch or take off your belt, you can just store them in there instead of having to dump them inside those security conveyor belt trays or bins. You can have them all inside this mesh compartment visible for security and protected as well. So that's the small little option there. You can store some small things in there when you're going through security. But for all other intents and purposes, it serves as another organization compartment for more gear. So you have further organization inside this zippered compartment to stash and store any little bits and pieces. Now behind that, we have a slip sleeve here that is secured down by magnets. Hopefully you can see there are magnets there. 
Generally speaking, you want to store things that you want really quick access to, but things that are relatively big and won't fall out easily because this is not a zippered compartment. So in here, I've actually just stored the shoulder strap, the attachable shoulder strap in there. And then just on the side here, I've got my Ozair face mask. Now, as mentioned, the Pact One duffel has the ability to open up clamshell, similar to what you would see in a suitcase style layout. So this central zipper here opens up clamshell, but we've also got two zippers on the side here, which actually give quick access to those dual compartments without necessarily having to open it up clamshell. And we'll take a look at how that actually works out later on. But opening up the main compartment zipper, we've got number 10 YKK RC zippers. And this gives us full visibility and access to our main compartment. So you can see one side has this mesh divider, the other side has this quilted pleated compartment here. This is actually the laptop sleeve. This laptop sleeve will fit up to 15 inch laptops and at most 16 inch laptops. So to get in there, you just need to unzip this zipper here and we have the laptop compartment in there. The good thing about having a laptop compartment in the middle is that it centralizes the weight distribution of the laptop, but it also allows for your travel gear, clothing, things like that to add more protection to your laptop. And so if you did want quick access to your laptop, you can leave this zipper open and when you want your laptop, you simply open up this zipper and access your laptop from there. So taking a look at some of the compartments, we'll go through this side on the left and just open up this quilted flap here. Now it's totally up to you how you want to organize your gear and what side you want to put certain pieces of gear. Here I've got shoes and toiletries on this side. So here I've got some sandals from Bedrock. These are really comfortable sandals which is really good for just a casual stroll. Over here I've got a Bellroy Dop Kit Plus for all of my toiletries. And here I've got the small packing cube from Air which is storing some other shoes in there. I've just got some sneakers from Monochrome there. Monochrome is actually an Australian company which is doing some really cool stuff with these Italian made sneakers. So you can check them out, links in the description below. And then once that's all emptied out, you can see there's a little bit more organization inside this little compartment. So we've got stretch mesh pockets on the sides which just allow you to segment and organize smaller bits and pieces. So they could be things from vitamins, maybe a belt, any other travel peripherals, things like that. I've just got my laptop charger inside there and on the other side, I have got anything in there. Here we have a zippered compartment which is just another way for you to segment gear. I've just got a cap here from Oliver's but if you had a book or reading material or anything like that you could store that in that compartment as well because it's a reasonably large compartment here. Moving on to the other side just opening up this mesh divider. I've got a little bit more gear in there. I've got an Arc'teryx Covert Cardigan Fleece. And then I've got a medium packing cube from Air, which has got all of my clothing inside. And here on the sides, I've just got a pair of polarized sunglasses from Sunski. And on the other side, I've got nothing in there. As you can see, we've got that same zippered compartment here on the side. And here I've stored the little laundry slash tote bag that actually comes with the Pact One duffel. You can see there's the Pact logo there stitched on the laundry bag. And this is just a small zippered compartment that allows you to store maybe your dirty clothes or anything like that. If you don't have a separate bag or a separate cube for those dirty clothes, you can put them in there and just separate your dirty clothes from your clean clothes. And as you can see, a little pocket here that allows you to stuff the entire laundry bag into this little section or you can also use it to store other bits and pieces inside there. Nice little additional piece of carry that allows you just to keep things clean and tidy. So that's an overview of the internals of the main compartment and this sort of dual compartment setup that we've got here. But as mentioned, if you don't want to open the bag completely clamshell and you just want to get quick access to something inside either of these dual compartments, you still can access them through these zippers here. So just looking at the top again, we've got that central zipper that opens opens it up clamshell and we've also got these side zippers here which allow us to have quick access to those dual compartments. So say for instance I want to quickly grab my fleece out, it's getting cold, I can just open this up and grab it out very easily. Or if there's something in my toiletry bag that I need quick access to, I can just open up this zipper and get to the toiletry bag. So even though there is the option of opening up completely clamshell, maybe when you're at your hotel or wherever you're staying, you can open it up so you can see everything, you also have the flexibility of just opening up those dual compartments independently and being able to access gear when you need to. Well everyone, that is the Pact One duffel bag. It is a well-designed duffel bag with a lot of organization and a very generous volume capacity at 35 liters. It's been designed with flexibility in mind. It's got the mobility of a traditional duffel bag, but it's also got the dual compartment organization that you typically get with suitcases as well. 
If you're interested in getting the Pact One duffel, there is a link in the description below. Using our affiliate links really do help support the work of the channel at no extra cost to you. But if you want to support us further, you can hit the like button, hit the bell, subscribe to the channel, and also subscribe to the newsletter. But we'd love to hear from you. What do you think about the Pact One duffel? What do you think about that dual compartment for open organization? Let us know your thoughts about that in the comments below. And as always, if you want to see more videos like this, check out some of the links on the screen at the end of this video. But for now, this has been the Pact One duffel. Take care and we'll see you next time.